Electronic Stability Program Vehicle without ESP But this time with ESP ESP prevents skidding How does ESP work? ESP counteracts skidding at an early stage By activating the brakes and if necessary by engine interventions ESP comprises speed sensor on each wheel your it sensor which measures the vehicle's rotation around its vertical axis a steering angle sensor which registers the driver's steering intention sensor signals which enable the control unit to compute when and how it should intervene and a hydraulic unit which builds up and reduces braking pressure on the brakes what happens during the steering maneuver the driver has to suddenly swerve to the left, but the vehicle does not respond to the driver's steering intention. The vehicle understeers, heading straight towards the obstacle. ESP briefly breaks the left rear wheel very sharply. This produces the desired countering force, so that vehicle responds as the driver intended. What happens during counter steering? When the driver turns the steering wheel to keep the vehicle in the left lane after avoiding the obstacle, the vehicle tends to oversteer, the rear end swerving to the left, the torque to the right is too high. In this case ESP breaks the left front wheel, the torque is reduced instead of going into a skid. ESP on. The ESP system will be in active mode, whenever the vehicle is turned on. The ESP warning indicator light blinks in the instrument cluster when it is in operation. ESP off. To maximize traction it may be beneficial to deactivate ESP. To deactivate ESP, press ESP off switch on the central bezel switchback, press ESP off switch again to activate ESP function.